okay. Today's story was chosen by Rosie. It's called The Little Fish Who Cried Shark. It's a surprising book, I think you'll see why. I wonder what else you notice about it as I'm reading the story. The Little Fish Who Cried Shark. Sprat was as cheeky as cheeky could be, the naughtiest fish in the whole of the sea. He loved to play tricks and thought it was fun to find lots of ways he could scare everyone. Boo! One day Sprat thought it would be the best lark to frighten the others by shouting out, Shark! He crept upon Crab and gave a great yell and giggled as Crab quickly hid in his shell. He swam up to Clam and called out, Shark attack! And Clam shut his shell with a terrified clack. Fool you, Sprat chuckled and leaving Clam there, he swam off to find someone else he could scare. Octopus dozed as the small fish swam by when, look out, it's a shark, came the terrible cry. He squeezed in his treasure chest trying to hide but couldn't quite fit all his eight legs inside. Down by the coral the eels bobbed about when suddenly, shark, came the gigantic shout. The eels disappeared down their holes with a plop and the naughty sprat laughed until ready to pop. Sprat scared the fish as they swam by through the sea. Look out, it's a shark, he will eat you for tea. With splishing and splashing, the fish raced for cover and Sprat laughed to see them swim into each other. Then one day, as Sprat was looking out for fun, he heard a great cry, swim away everyone. But Sprat wouldn't listen. He said, don't you fear, I won't fall for that one. There's no shark around here. But as he turned round, the sea grew quite dark. Help, shouted terrified Sprat. It's a shark. Yikes. And from that time on, naughty Sprat changed his ways and played no more tricks for the rest of his days. Thank you for listening, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the story. Thank you, Rosie, for choosing our story today. I'd like to dedicate this out to my nieces and nephews, Arian, Avani, Kaith and Soraya, as they absolutely love this story. Take care, everyone. Bye for now.